I also added some cumin, paprika, garlic, and Old Bay. Greetings one all, how's everyone doing? I hope well, hope you're having a great weekend. Um, I did a poll a few days ago. Uh, I was gonna make lasagna anyway, but I was wondering, oh, what if I should make a video? And the uh, majority of the vote said yes, so let's, uh, let's show you how I'm gonna do it. All right, I already showed you the ground beef. I'm using, uh, I know I'm using jarred sauce. I actually got one of these little jars too. Because uh, I never felt like there was enough sauce in my previous lasagnas. So, I'm adding Just make sauce. sure I get all the goodness out of it. I'll throw in a little bit of water. That way I can get all the goodness out of there. Okay, the last time I made this, I put it in a glass baking dish. But it kind of ran out the sides a little bit and burned on the bottom of my oven. So I went on Amazon and I bought this big sucker. So I may not go all the way to the edges, but it'll have enough room for it to uh, kind of spread out. So we're going to use the ground beef is cooking. I'm also going to be adding this uh, thing of uh, mushrooms. They didn't have any whole mushrooms. So and while I'm this. not going to record it, I've got a great a whole bunch of cheese. So I basically need a one pound block of mozzarella. And then I'm also going to top it with an eight ounce block of pepper jack. And I got my ricotta sitting out. I'm going to be adding this as well. I won't need that until all this is uh, cooked. And this is all grated, but like I said, there's no need to show you the grating because it's, well, it's boring. Get the mushrooms going as well. I got a lean ground beef, so I'm gonna have to add a little oil to cook the mushrooms off. All right, once your meat's all cooked up, I'm gonna transfer it to your pan with your sauce. Stir that in. I think we can start summer. building here. Uh, Non-stick spray. Mostly the sides because you're gonna that way the cheese won't fully stick. Now, if you're a lasagna purist, you might want to look away because I'm using these oven-ready uh, lasagna sheets. I know. You're like, wait, what? So, of course, you always go sauce first. So, this is, pan is significantly bigger, so I think I'm going to go three, although, I may do a fourth, like that, pan may be a little bit bigger than I but it's all right. Then you go with a layer of ricotta. Now I've seen uh, Chef John at foodwishes.com put his in a bowl with eggs and Parmesan, kind of mix it all together. I'm being lazy. And I admit that I'm being lazy. Pan might be a bit bit big, but it's all right. We will just have to deal. So. Uh, I can get away with three sheets on this layer.
I really honestly should be going the full pan, but like I said, the pan is uh, a bit bigger than planned, but that's all right. Make sure I was recording. This is definitely gonna be a very cheesy, a very cheesy lasagna. See, so I got three. Oven's preheated. Just because I don't want to waste them, I'm going to put these two on top. It's officially used salt. All the sauce. The rest of the cheese. Top it with pepper jack. Got a little left over, but I can always throw that in my. And one more ingredient eggs. is uh, shredded parmesan. Now this thing bakes, it's gonna it's gonna flatten out and probably spread out the whole bottom of the pan, so I'm not really too worried. Alright, okay. so what we wanna do is cover this whole thing in foil. The, all the steam coming off let's get that sucker in the oven So, 45 minutes at 375. All right, it has been 45 minutes. Get this sucker pulled out. Gotta get, get uh, well, I guess gotta pull the foil off and uh, put it in for another 15 as it slides off. Wow, how much would that have sucked, by the way? That would have really sucked. Ow. As I get steam burns. Yeah, good. That felt nice. Ah, look at that. I hope that's coming through. Yeah, yeah, timer, I'm coming. All right, another 15. Man, I really wish there was smell tube because this smells freaking amazing. Look at this. Oh, oh. Open the door to a heat wave. Ah. Oh. Oh, Look man. at that. Mmm. That looks phenomenal. Oh, smells amazing, too. I knew it was going to spread out a little bit, so I was a little worried, to be honest. Oh, shut up. Do a big timer. So, this will be way too hot to eat, so I'm going to give it a few to sit and settle. And, uh, 
Yeah, I'll come back and taste it. Yeah, it, uh, this smells too damn good to wait, so. I think I've waited enough. It's been about 10 minutes or so. Oh man, look at that. I'm sure I've mentioned it probably a few times, but I love lasagna. I mean, what's not to love? Meat, cheese, deliciousness. Get a little of that extra parmesan on top. I'm a big fan of black pepper. All right. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh man. Mm. Hot, but mm. that is freaking delicious. I'm gonna go sit down and eat this. Uh, but I wanted to thank you for watching, and um, I think I'm gonna do at some point is I'm, gonna, I'm probably gonna look for a, another pan again. And I like this one, but I think it's too wide. So maybe I'll, I'll look. I get the measurements off the glass dish, and get a deeper one instead of a bigger one. I'm gonna sit down and eat this, and uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.